So guys, this is the Raspberry Pi Zero module that I have received. And uh, let's check out the hardware. So over here, you, have, you get two USB ports. The first one is for power. Second one is to be used for like the interfacing peripherals, like keyboard, mouse, or wireless dongle, etc. Then again, we get another port. There's a mini HDMI port to connect display. And over here is the 40 pin GPIO rails that is similar to Raspberry Pi 2 and Raspberry Pi Plus models. So over here is the micro SD socket the, where you can put your SD card containing the OS. So this module actually doesn't come with uh, like 4 USB ports in case of P Plus and 2 and Ethernet uh, onboard Ethernet actually. So for networking you need to depend on wireless or you can use external Ethernet controller with the GPIO. And this comes with 512 MB of RAM. So this is a comparison between one B plus model and Raspberry Pi Zero. You can see the size difference between two because it doesn't have onboard or peripherals like the Raspberry Pi 2 or B plus. Okay. So it doesn't have also like 3.5 mm music. So the audio over here you can get only through the HDMI port. And over here you can see the RAM chip because the processor is below the RAM chip. You can't see the processor unlike your other Raspberry Pi boards. And over here you get one LED that shows you the connectivity. So that's all with hardware guys. Let's put up with Raspberry Pi JC Lite OS. So guys, I have burned my OS into this SD card. So let's put it over here into the SD card socket. One mini HDMI to HDMI converter into the HDMI socket. And the keyboard connector or mini USB to USB converter over here. And we'll connect power over here so then we can power it up. So let's switch it on and check out on the display. me once again and hope you have enjoyed the video please hit the thumbs up button if you have liked it and put your comments down below and don't forget to subscribe my channel to get the latest updates thank you